after completing my UG, uh, my father was trying to make me a doctor in the, uh, his own pharmacy. But I told you before, I was always attracted in teachership. And so I decided to be a teacher. In my uh, in that period, ladies were very few in the Ayurveda colleges as students. So I was always uh, very something like a naughty, I can say, <laughs> and uh, not be very strict to one thing and doing like that and uh, uh, humble, not like that. So one day, what happened? One of my teacher told me. He's a very renowned teacher and very. Uh, I was a pet to him also. He told me, you are not suitable to study Ayurveda, he told me. Just like a, um, a mocking like that. Then I told him that, no, I will, uh, I will study Ayurveda and I will teach Ayurveda. That is my promise like that. Oh, let me see, like that. Then I told him, I have to be a teacher anyway. That was a, uh, just like a pledge I was taking. Since that, doctor, that teacher told me that you are not suitable for uh, studying Ayurveda. Then I told him, I will study Ayurveda and I will teach Ayurveda like that. Then what happened? Uh, so after completing this, uh, my UG, I had to take PG anyway to become teacher. Then I, was, uh, I decided to go for PG level. And then that was my first step why I was going to PG, the PG scholar. Then I was always, not because the disease of the eye, I was attracted to beauty of the eye, actually. And uh, then I was thinking, why this, uh, we are able to see, but all examples are coming to uh, eye, just like the eye of a fox, eye of a, uh, this crow, or we can see without eye, these um, saints are seeing with their uh, inner eye, like that, so many things are connected with the eye, 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 like that. So I think whether we are seeing with this thing, with the eye or with something else, like that some doubts were in my mind. And uh, after all, when we just close our eye, nothing is there. And just opening the eye, a huge, a wide world is in, in our friend. So, such a small thing, what is the mystery behind this? That was my attraction. Not the disease of the eye, actually. The mystery, I always, even now I am doubtful. Is it because of this organ we are seeing all these things? And by shutting the lid, everything is closed, nothing is there again. And uh, all these things are stored in our mind, like that. So many questions are there. So I was attracted with the functioning and, with, and also the uh, capability, function of the eye. That was why I was, uh, and also, it is so much beautiful and we can do anything with our, with our eyes. We can talk with our eyes. We can convey our, uh, our intentions, our thoughts, our, we can measure this status of our mind through eye. These are the facts which attracted me to the eye. I used to write simple, small poems about eye and write some articles on uh, about I and uh, because the eye of Shiva is disturbing and uh, burning everything but the eye of Vishnu is a blessing thing. So I was writing one article that is a, a, a series of eyes from the blessing to the utmost uh, uh, destroying. When the third eye of Shiva is uh, opened, everything is uh, gone. When the eye of Vishnu or Mahavishnu is open, it is a highly blessing thing like that. So many things connected with the eye, here and there, here and there. And these all were the attracting factors actually. Not the uh, vision and its uh, disease and suffering, not because of that. And once I came to this field, the both became joints. Without um, solving the problems of the eye, Nobody can enjoy the beauty of this world uh, with this uh, sense organ. So that was the reason why I was selecting the eye and its diseases, not Shalakya as such. So even now I am uh, interesting, uh, Shalakya means 
all the diseases about the ear, nose, throat and head, everything comes under Shalakya. Now there are special um, um, this, uh, options for studying each thing, disease of ENT and disease of head only like that, but I am always interested in disease of eye. It doesn't mean that I am not able to treat other disease, but I am especially interested in this, uh, this only. Because uh, we can see, without I, life is nothing. In Ayurveda itself, there is a slogan like that. Tulli ratrin divanam pumsam andhan. That means, for a blind man, this uh, day and night is equal. Life is nothing for them. And that line also was very highly influenced to me. Without I, day and night are equal. Then what about the life? That is one thing. So, even though life is, um, I is that much beautiful, that much capable, but it should be functioning. And the functioning is, it is destroyed by different types of disease. So, it is the duty or responsibility of a person who love I to keep it functioning. So, we have to handle disease and to uh, treat it and make it uh, bring to normal. That is why I was interested in the eye treatment of eye disease.